I decided to find out what the is going on in this picture and why is Drake on the red carpet smizing with the whole crew from Euphoria. If you want to know what's going on, keep watching this video. Welcome to I Have a Mission. We've all heard the buzz about this new show on HBO called Euphoria starting Zendaya. It has been well anticipated and people have really fallen in love with the show's concept of making teenage high school drama a bit spicier to say the least. How do you navigate in a world full of sex, drugs and social media? In the midst of trying to figure out who the people behind this brilliant show are, I came across this picture. Yes, that's Drake. Drizzy. Best I ever had Drake. Uh, best I ever had. I'm in my feelings, Drake. There he was in front of the flashing cameras, smiling. Was he in the show and you just missed him? Was he in the background at all those dark parties? No, he's an executive producer of the show. How did this happen? First, we need to know that Drake actually got his start in the hit show Degrassi, where he played the character Jimmy Brooks for about eight years. Degrassi also followed the bunch of kids in high school in their everyday struggles. I would say Degrassi was an early version of Euphoria, so Drake is definitely experienced in those kinds of shows. A simple Google search shows that the first two people listed as executive producers is Sam Levinson and of course Drake. I want to show you guys this first clip of Zendaya getting asked about Drake on the red carpet. I met him on set, yeah. Oh, he came to set? Yeah, he came to set once and, oh. and I that was one of the first times I got to meet him, which is like, cool. So Euphoria took eight months to film. Eight months. That's 243 days, 34 weeks. And shouldn't the executive producer be a little bit more involved, especially since their job description says that they lead the production and that they ensure that the film is completed on time and they are responsible for the overall quality control of productions. I don't know about you, but I could never lead a production that I've only been to a handful of times. It seems like Zendaya isn't the only one who's unclear about Drake's involvement in the show. The same interviewer caught up with the other lead actress, Hunter Schaefer. Like in the middle of shooting a scene and he just kind of like came through said and we all gave him a hug. And, and, yeah. Are you a fan? Yeah, yeah. We, I mean, especially after this because, because like, he's involved and I don't know he's just like you know yeah Hunter also seems a bit confused on what to say when asked about Drake. Couldn't she just have said, yes, he's one of our executive producers and he was involved doing this, this, and this. Instead, Hunter just seems startled and honestly, a little bit awkward. Just for comparison, I want to show you guys a clip where Zendaya is talking about Sam Levinson, who I mentioned earlier as the other executive producer of the show Euphoria. Do you draw the inspiration for the drug usage? Director Sam Levinson mm -hmm. um, struggled with addiction for a long part of his life, and um, a lot of what Rue is and stems from and cr was created from is, is himself and his own personal stories and his own life. So. Um, so I, I, we just have a lot of like open dialogue, a lot of like conversations and he's like just an open book with his life, which gotcha. I'm very thankful. In this clip, you can clearly hear how informed Zendaya is about Sam's life and where he got his inspiration from regarding the drug use on the show. Sam actually shares that he used to be a drug addict and that's why he could assist Zendaya in really living in her role as Rue Bennett. Zendaya also talks about how open Sam is and that they've had long talks. Now remember how she talked about Drake? So I'm just confused. Why is everyone making it seem like Drake was more involved in the show than he appears to be. Was it to gain more attention to the show? Or was Drake more involved behind the scenes and it just never came to the light? Either way, it just seems very strange at this point. I would love to hear what you guys think about this whole situation. Am I reading too much into this? And what do you think about the show? Leave your comments below. And of course, if you like this video, hit that subscribe button. And I'll talk to you guys another time. Bye.